An armed man spotted on a Metro Atlanta high school campus prompts a lockdown, a manhunt, and it all ends with a deadly shootout with law enforcement. Within the last couple of hours, we learned the person killed was 29-year-old Stephen Blunt of Douglasville. The whole thing caught on ring camera, and we have that video tonight. And folks, we want to warn you, some of you may find it very disturbing. Let's get straight out to 11 Alive's Cody Alcorn, who is in Lauren and Douglasville right now. So, Cody, you also spoke with a man who saw the suspect and actually helped lead deputies to him, right? Ron, it's an interview you'll see only on 11 Alive. Jerome Orr says he'd actually just finished watching his grandson compete here behind me at Special Olympics inside the New Manchester High School football stadium. And he says that's when all of a sudden he saw a guy now identified as Stephen Blunt run from this gate with an officer right behind him. I just seen the young man running. We heard the um, police officer say he has a gun. Douglas County Schools put New Manchester High School on lockdown. This text sent to parents just after 1130 Wednesday morning as to what exactly prompted all of it. We received a call about a male with a gun at the special limits. The SROs chased him. Jerome Orr says it was just as his wife snapped this picture. He ran right by us and I was, you know, and caught me off guard. You can see him looking away. Uh, five seconds after he ran by us, the officer came right behind him. Orr says as the suspect was running out of the stadium. Right before he went through the gate, I see his phone fell out of his pocket. The officer was right behind him. So me, I just picked it up and waited till the officer got through chasing him and gave him the telephone. The sheriff's office says the cell phone led them to this home on Ferncrest Place, which is about two miles from the school. And what happened next was caught on a doorbell camera. You see the man walk outside as deputies show up. It's only 16 seconds later, shots ring out. Now, we're stopping the video as soon as you see the man appear to pull a gun. But you'll hear the first shots fired between the suspect and a deputy. It was all over in four seconds. I counted 10 shots. The shootout happening just feet from the front door of this home. And you can see evidence markers in the front yard. A typically quiet neighborhood filled with deputies for hours into Wednesday night. And what was a fun-filled morning over at New Manchester High School quickly changed. Turned a good day into a bad day. That made me um, angry more than anything. Now, the homeowner where this shootout happened said Stephen Blunt was staying with her. He was considered just a family friend. Now, she says her son was actually competing here as well, which brought Blunt over here to watch her son compete. Now, as to why he was apparently armed, why he ran from officers, and why he decided to engage in this shootout, that is something the GBI is investigating tonight.